Ooh, laying those ladies down, Lorna. Very nice. I may have done a bit of that when I was drinking. You don't remember? I'd make out with bartenders for shots. Well, sometimes. Oh, everyone does that when you're in college. College? It was two years ago. <laughs> so I'm thinking about joining Abby in Costa Rica. Are you going to visit her? Abby would just love that. We are not exactly the um, mother-daughter tandem type. She's told me a lot of really wonderful stories about you. I, I doubt that. Like the time that you taught her to swim in Lake Michigan? How sweet. Oh, but then a big wave came and bowled both of you over, and she almost drowned, but then her dad ran in and saved both of you. Yeah. I am so pleased to hear your grandmother's out of the hospital and home recuperating. Oh, Connie, right. That's great. So I imagine that means you're going back to Minneapolis soon. No, New York, actually. It's a big gaming conference. <laughs> Can you believe they pay me five grand to talk about basic game coding? No. Marilyn, you'd be great at coding. It's, it's basically what you're doing here anyway. Uh, I prefer three-dimensional games. Lorna, you love video games, right? Oh, it's my new addiction. Calms me down. I can send you the unreleased version of the game I'm working on. I think you'd really love it. It's um, these little fruits, right? And they argue, and they have family problems, and like Patty the Pineapple inherits Grandpa Grape's fortune, right? But then she like gambles it all away at this gas station that sells fortune cookies. Well, I want to be Patty the Pineapple. So what's the point of this game? How do you win? Oh, well, so it's these little fruits, and they fall from different planets, uh -huh. and there's actually a lot of ways to get knocked out, but if you can figure out who the rotten fruit is and who the good fruit is... Well, that's pretty easy to spot the bad fruit. Oh. No, not if it's rotting from the inside. <laughs> <laughs> okay, come on, Alicia. You can't win Fuck. every hand. <laughs> oh. Hey. How's it going? Hey, honey. We were just waiting for you. Come on. Come sit down. You told me to let you know when I was leaving, but I couldn't get a hold of you, so... She was just telling us all about her tiny fruit. Okay. Um, well, I'm exhausted, so... Oh, do you want me to head back to the hotel? No, um, stay. I will sleep on the floor. Well, we can both sleep on the floor. <laughs> Make some tea, Lorna. You'll be pissing all night. Gotta do something. You look cute. <laughs> so how's your um downstairs area? Oh, uh, good, 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 good. Uh, <laughs> but I don't necessarily feel like Oh, yeah, I'm... no, I get it. Clean as a whistle doesn't mean you need to blow it, right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> But you're not itchy. That's great. I'm always itchy. If you were itchy, I have some cream. But I think it's I think it's okay to be itchy a little it's bit. It's okay. I don't regret scratching that itch. <laughs> um, well, I'm gonna brush my teeth. I'll okay. show you my room. Great. Um, so. You can brush your teeth and I'll I can read your diaries. Yeah. Oh yeah, do that. Because the entry from two days ago is really good. Yeah? Yeah. Are you already in Costa Rica? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Thanks for letting me stay here tonight. Mm. It's your last night. I feel bad. You're on the ground. 
Yeah, sorry I'm being such a grump. I'm just, uh, I'm so... Oh, no, hey, I get it. You don't want a girlfriend. You're leaving, I'm leaving. I'm just really happy that I got to meet you at a crazy house. Isn't it all one big crazy house? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just not used to feeling this down for so long. I just cannot wait to have my own place again and be far away. Yeah. I like your mom. She's really cool. She's really smart. Can we not talk about Marilyn? <laughs> Please. Thanks. How about I tell you all about my job? And before you know it, you'll be right asleep. You can try, but I'm very hard to put to sleep. So you'll go to sleep, and when you wake up, you'll feel alive and refreshed and ready for adventure. <laughs> I promise, Abby. So, when I first conceived of Patty the Pineapple, I knew there were a lot of aspects of the world I needed to flesh out. So there were the avatars, and then I wanted the avatars to have avatars, so it would be kind of meta. <laughs>